Today, we are reacting to Godzilla armor. This video's been out for a while, but we're finally getting to now, it. Now, when I see the words Godzilla armor, I'm thinking about like a human with like some Godzilla scales on his back or something like that. I, I don't really know. But we are going to be finding it out today. There's also a lot of other kaijus in the title, like Skullcrawler, Methuselah, Behemoth. A lot should be going on. And do you think the armor is going to have like superpowers or something like that? Like an atomic breath? I think it does have a big sword. But we're going to see all that in a minute. This video is by Pandy. I'll come up on the screen right now so you can see it. Let's go ahead and get to it. We're starting off with a skull crawler right here. Do you think the gods of the armor is going to be able to defeat everything? I would say yes. Depending on how big it is. Baby Godzilla, what are you doing out here? You better get inside somewhere. Where's your dad? You better go get that man. I'm ready to see what the gods of the armor looks like. And maybe by the end, he's done chopped up everybody really curious. Like I said, this video's been out for like a year. I don't know why I've waited so long, but we're here. It's all good. <laughs> don't worry. Maybe Godzilla in a cave. Maybe pulling up on his dad. Big G. Oh, I don't think he's ever been in this cave. And I think we might get our first look right here at the Godzilla armor. Is it a human in the... Okay, skull crawler came out of nowhere. Let's see what this armor looks like. Come on, show us. So is it a human? I mean, the baby Godzilla is kind of big. You know, he's not ginormous. That suit looks okay. It is a human. It might be like an attack on Titan size person though. That armor is so cool. Hold up. I want to see the sword come out. I saw it on his back. Oh, here we go. Is he taking it? Let me see it. Ooh! Okay, hold up. We got to pause right here and examine the suit. Like I said in the beginning, it does have those Godzilla dorsal plates on it. And then the sword, it's got like that blue going all the way up the middle. That thing looks absolutely beautiful. I'm liking the armor. Just like that. Oh my goodness! Look how massive this man is, by the way! That's a human! Shout out to this guy. Alright, I don't know who it is, but... He's got Godzilla armor. Methuselah? Yeah, buddy, please don't. You're gonna get your head chopped off. Or at least a few trees. No, no. Don't do it to him. Oh, hold up. Oh, he blocked it. Okay. Does this suit have any more powers though? That's what I want to know. Hold up. Atomic sword breath. That would be crazy. That's exactly what it is. Okay. I need me some God's alarm. Is it doing anything to him? Yes, it is. Okay. <laughs> Atomic breath from the sword. Who, who would have guessed it? Don't chop his head off, please. Godzilla, don't! Well, I called him Godzilla. Uh, what should we even call him? Let's call him Bob. We got Bob with Godzilla armor on. Now they're talking? Okay, maybe they're friends now. I don't think- okay. He didn't chop him down. He's giving him a ride. Okay. I like it. Bob with Godzilla armor. Who's he gonna be fighting next? We had a few other names in this video. Is that Big Behemoth? I think it is. He could cut off a tusk. Use it as horns like the Loki helmet. That would be cool. Don't do that though. Let Behemoth live. I like me some Behemoth. And that would just be wrong. <laughs> Don't do it to him, please. He's letting him down though. Here we go. Wait, why did Godzilla get down? Maybe Godzilla. Oh, because it's going to be a fight. Ah, dang! I want to know where regular Godzilla is and why he's just letting his baby wander through the woods. Godzilla armor versus Behemoth. Let's see. Are you kidding me? 
Godzilla armor or mob, whatever you want to call them. Let's see what else Bob's got in store for us. I want to see some other moves, man. Like if he did the, uh, you know, if he threw the sword and then a beam came out. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just trying to guess some things here. Taking out the sword again. That man can jump really high, by the way. What did I say? I told you it cut off the tusks. I knew he was going to do that. Now, if he actually wears them as horns like Loki, that would be crazy. At that point, I can just see the future. Behemoth is like, did you really just do that to me, sir? Are you kidding me? I don't like that he did that. Because now look at Behemoth. I think they grow back, right? We'll say that they grow... Grow back. Biolante is here. And Behemoth can't even fight him off. Her off, sorry. He ain't got no tusks. I feel like it's only right that Godzilla armor, a.k.a. Bob, goes back and helps. Oh, Biolante has Methuselah's tail. Biolante. It's a scary kaiju. Pulling him back. That's how strong Biolante is. Look at the size. Oh no, not Bob. Not Bob and Baby G. Finally, Godzilla. Where have you been, man? Your baby has just been traversing around this place here. Bob was over there smiling. Ooh, what if he, like, powers up the sword? Like the axe, you know what I'm saying? Okay, not yet. Biolante's head? Oh my goodness! Is he gonna fight Bob? Because of the armor? Let me see. Said, Dad, where you been? Bob just bows down to him, okay. I guess so. Methuselah's just laying on the ground right now. Okay, so they're leaving Bob, aka Godzilla Harbor, and Methuselah behind. I mean, it makes sense. Why is it? What's it leading up to right now? What is that? Okay, well, that is the end of this video. But who who was doing all that roaring? I don't know if there's a part two to the gods of the armor. You guys let me know down in the comments. We will definitely check it out. But for right now, I will see you on tomorrow's video. Thank you for watching with me. I love you. Goodbye.